Feel the current, navigating the streams of language. Hello and welcome, dear viewers. Today, we're embarking on a fascinating journey to understand the essence of the phrase, feel the current. This expression, though simple in words, carries a depth of meaning and is widely used in various contexts. Let's dive into the nuances and applications of this phrase, ensuring you can not only understand it but also use it confidently in your conversations. At its core, feel the current is a metaphorical phrase. It's derived from the physical experience of feeling the flow of water in a river or stream against one's body. When someone says they feel the current, they're often referring to sensing or understanding the prevailing trends, opinions, or atmosphere in a particular situation or environment. It's about having an intuitive grasp of the direction in which things are moving, much like a swimmer feels the direction of water flow. In social situations, in social contexts, to feel the current might mean to understand the general mood or opinions in a group of people. For instance, when entering a meeting or a party, you might feel the current to gauge the atmosphere. Is it tense, relaxed, or enthusiastic? In professional settings, in the workplace, feeling the current could relate to understanding company culture or the market trend. For example, a marketer might feel the current of consumer preferences to tailor their campaigns effectively. In personal decision-making, on a personal level, feeling the current can mean being in tune with your own emotions and thoughts guiding your decisions and actions in a way that aligns with your inner state and values. Before launching the new product, the team took the time to feel the current of the market to predict its success. At the party, she could feel the current of excitement in the air, knowing it was going to be a memorable night. He's always been good at feeling the current. He knows when to push for change and when to ride the wave of tradition. Understanding and using the phrase, feel the current, can add a layer of depth to your conversations and reflections. It's about being perceptive, empathetic, and in tune with your surroundings and your inner self. We hope this exploration has illuminated this phrase for you and that you can now feel the current of language more confidently. Thank you for joining us, and may your linguistic journey be as enriching and exhilarating as the currents you navigate.